What is up guys? Welcome back to the YouTube channel. Today's video, we're going to be unlocking the gold MP5. As most of us know, the MP5 is definitely one of the most popular guns at the beginning of the game. It's not so much now because it got nerfed, but this is a gun that I initially got gold right away and obviously didn't do much recording before I decided to do the series for Road to Diamond. With the bug that everyone was experiencing uh, where it would be the game would basically take away your camos, my MP5 gold camo was taken away from me and I had to redo at least a couple kills in the uh, point blank camo challenge so in today's video you're gonna see some old uh, recording uh, an old stream of mine from when i was using mp5 more often the mp5 was the only gun i was using when the game launched so the beginning footage you're gonna see is an old stream of mine at the very end you're going to see some newer gameplay of where i had to re-unlock the point blank range to officially have gold camo on my mp5 also in the middle of the video i i give my thoughts on skill-based matchmaking and how I want it to be removed as so does everyone else in the Call of Duty community. So stay tuned for that and let's get right into it. Wow, are you fucking kidding me? Bro, dude, get me out of here. Holy shit. I don't like the score streaks. I wish they made him kill streaks. Or at least had two separate categories kill streak and score streaks because the score streaks are. You could get a chopper gunner. As long as you're getting enough score, you can get a chopper gunner without having to go on a long streak. Which. It, it adheres to the the bad players of the game, and I I don't really like that. And this game really really, but it adheres to 
the bad players, I should say, the ones that don't play COD a lot. And it's just like, okay, you can't do that with a Call of Duty game because a lot of people that play Call of Duty are people that play it all the time and that are actually somewhat decent at the game. When you add here in a COD game to specifically players that don't play a lot and they're not very good, you know, it kind of messes up the people that that are good at the game. And this includes uh, skill-based matchmaking. Like, skill-based matchmaking ruins the game for good players because they're going against other good players and it kind of, you know, makes the game unenjoyable for them. What they should do is just have no skill-based matchmaking. You just let it be random. You know, don't base it on skill. And then I feel like it would be a lot better of a game. And, but the problem is, is no matter what people say, no matter what, Activision's never gonna get rid of skill-based matchmaking. It's just never gonna be a thing. And it sucks. But I get what you mean, bro. Maybe they will update it. No, they're they're definitely not gonna update it. And the problem is, is so many people have speak their minds on it. A lot of big YouTubers, and I know Activision hears them, but they don't care. They don't care because they, I don't really understand why they implemented skill-based matchmaking, but I think it's because, like I said, when I explained it before, skill-based matchmaking is you have the you know bases on your skills. So if you have good players, they go against good players. You have bad players, you go against bad players. So you, you, you're you going against people that have, with the same skill. And what I think is they have it for the bad players so they don't get too mad at the game where they stop playing completely because they want to keep those play people playing when you have when you don't have skill based matchmaking you can have a lobby where a crazy insane player is is destroying the entire lobby and people just you know people that are not that good at it keep dying and dying and dying can't get kills they're gonna eventually stop playing the game so that's why i think they have skill based matchmaking and that's why they're probably never going to get rid of it unfortunately there's a public lobby it should be random and then there should be a competitive there should be a separate playlist for competitive play where you're playing against the same people with the same skill and they've had that in other cause before but recently they have just been adding skill based matchmaking to everything and it kind of destroys it Team for a lot of match. people because you know you know obviously good players want to go on pu uh, public lobbies and they want to you know just play casually and not have to be competitive all right guys we are right there to unlocking mp5 gold so as we all know there before the update came out to fix the uh bug where it will would take your camos away i did have this gold already and that bug affected me so the only camo i have to unlock is this one the point blank range and multiplayer and we all know this is definitely by far the <laughs> worst uh, and most annoying camo in the game for smgs so this is going to be quite an annoying match, but uh, bear with me, we are going to get this gold. Here we go, there's one. Oh, uh, I always fucks me up. Doesn't count. There we go. Let's go. We get it. There we go, got it. And there you guys have it, the gold MP5. I did have this quite a while back before the bug actually affected this gun. This is one of my first guns, I got gold. Obviously we are just finishing up because of the bug, but I'm happy we got it done and over with. If you guys enjoyed the video today, please drop a like down below. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any more Grow to Diamond videos. And comment down below, what do you think of MP5? Is it a overused gun? Do you think it's still a decent gun to use after the update, after it got nerfed? Uh, let me know down below in the comments uh, what your opinion on the MP5 is. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.